Hi, and welcome to my small little guide um, about cading. Yes, uh, we are on Zombiezone, Zombie Survival Servers, and I'm going to show you the basics of cading. The very basics. Um, to keep it uh, simple and short. Yes, I'm stuck on the door frame. Let me just give myself um, guard mode for the purpose of this video. And I'll watch your weapon so I can get rid of this annoying door. Get away, thank you very much. Okay. So we wanna open the shop menu with uh, you can buy. Uh, so you can open the shop menu with the F2 key. Then if you want to buy anything, you go either to home, weapon, skins, heal above, K and repair, or others. Or you don't need to worry about other. Uh, for now, let's just go to home then to traits, buy the muscular trait. And if you can't buy the muscular trait, that is done because because. It's uh, currently, uh, maybe, well, well, I say currently, but if you can't buy the muscular trait, then it's probably because uh, you're in wave 1, wave 2, wave 3, whatever wave, and you can only buy traits during the prepare phase. So, if that is the case, then you need to go to heal and buff, then to buff uh, again. Uh, click on buff, I mean. And then over here, you can look down here and click on steroids. You can buy this. This does basically the same as muscular does. Anyway, so I'm going to go to Kate, I'm gonna go to Kading and buy a Carbonus Hammer and a bunch of nails for the purpose of this video. Alright, so you see all of these props here in this room. First basic of this tutorial, the first basic knowledge you should have. So I'm going to claim this room and how I'm gonna do this, how I'm gonna claim this room as my Kate. Simple as this. You just go around and nail the props, either to the wall, to the floor, to the ceiling, to another prop that is uh, nailed to the floor. And you basically do this to all of the props that you want to use for your arcade. And if you don't nail a prop, like, let's just say I forgot to nail this barrel here on top, and someone comes in and steals it, well then it's gone. You can uh, maybe ask the pe the person to give the barrel back, but if you failed to nail the barrel in the first place, then uh, yeah, you might need to ever either ask the player, maybe ask a moderator for help, or uh, uh, just forget about the barrel. But anyways, so I'm going to make a small delicate. So the first thing that you don't want to do is this. You never want you never want to do this. Yep. This is terrible. Because the zombies can hit the prop from behind the cover. They, this is a wall, as you can see, obviously. And the zombies can just, uh, just uh, sit here and hit the prop and break the prop. And they will be in, in your cage in no time. Because you can't kill the zombies. So, you also don't want to do this. It's also terrible, because the zombies can just walk here through. and. This is a pro tip, always test your cage, so if you as a human player can walk through your cage without without phasing, phasing by the way, you do that with your, uh, with your this key or this key, uh, you can phase through props, uh, nailed or unnailed props, and if you can un if you can get in your cage without phasing, then zombies can so do, uh, can, do can do the same, holy shit, I can talk. Anyways. Um, Yes, what you... oh shit. What you also don't want to do... Is... Let's just say you learn from your mistakes and you move the props inside so that the, that the prop is not exposed. And you do this. It's, it's a common mistake I keep seeing on the server. A lot of people do this. A lot of new people, I mean. Um, they think this is good. But this is actually terrible. You, you just saw what I mean. I'll wait for the next bot and you will see why this is terrible. Why you shouldn't do this. Come on, bot. See? The bot just crouch jumped into the gap between the shells. And you can do that too. So this is terrible. Don't do this. And... Instead... Of course, now the bot shows up. Is that another bot? Uh, instead, you wanna do. You wanna tilt the prop also slightly. Oh my god, freaking unbelievable. Let me just get rid of this, well, these gips here. 
Yeah, really annoying. Get out of here. Okay, you wanna tilt the prop. Just like that. And boom. And now, the bots can't actually jump in from outside. You can try yourself, you can't get in. Voila, easy as that. And you always want, you should, and you always uh, want to double nail your props. See this? One nail, two nail. One nail, bad. Two nail, good. Don't, don't single nail, always double nail. For the love of God, always double nail. Because if you don't double nail your prop, and the nail breaks, then the bots, the prop will be unnailed, and the props can push the prop, and the bots can also launch and throw the prop at your face and prop kill you. Or prop kill your teammates, which uh, sucks, so... Always, always double nail. So remember, for your future, always double nail the props. Test your Kate so that uh, you can't actually jump from the outside into your Kate. Because if you can, if you can do this, bots and other players obviously can do it too. And also don't overexpose your props. And by overexposing, I obviously mean... Uh, I obviously mean... This. This is overexposing. This is uh, extreme overexposing, but yeah, don't do this. Anyways, uh, thank you for watching, and if you have any questions, if you are un unsure about anything, just ask in the comments, ask on the Discord server, or maybe ask on the server itself, and I will try to answer your question when I'm if I'm around. And yeah, see you in my next one.